Hey guys, so I wanted to do a quick little video looking at uh, Android 7.1.2 Nugget here for the Galaxy A5 2017. Uh, props to someone called, I think it's Pum Masterone, who actually said that there was uh, like a build here for the A5 2017 based upon uh, the Lineage OS. So this is a nice uh, like uh, Nugget pixel experience here and obviously Samsung is taking its sweet time to get the official software on so you know it's quite good that we do have some support for this device and a lot of things obviously are pretty outdated in terms of Marshmallow uh, so this is Android 7.1.2 based upon your Nugget uh, patch level here uh, so pretty much the latest official software uh, for the device and it's coming with a very nice uh, Nugget build here you can see uh, very similar to your Pixel devices in terms of the animations uh, as well as the notification area uh, you also have your swipe area as well for your Google Now and I just wanted to check out as well some of the things to see if they're working here uh, so if we just have a look at the fingerprint sensor because I think a lot of people you know, we'll want to see uh, if it is uh, working here. So we'll just go to the fingerprint and then add a fingerprint here. Uh, so we can just use the pattern. Wow, you have different sizes now, I didn't know that. So you can have even bigger kind of patterns, it seems, uh, with Nugget. So let's see if this works. Uh, so I think this is actually not working at the moment uh, in terms of the fingerprint sensor you can see it crashes when you go into it maybe they'll fix that obviously with future updates but do be aware of it if you do like your biometric security let's have a look at the camera here uh, to see if that's working so a uh, camera is obviously quite important for a lot of people just take a shot here You can see it seems to take an image nice and sharp. Uh, what about the video recording? How do we get to that? Let's try that one. Nah. So you see, this uh, has an issue with the video recording. Uh, so something to consider again there when it comes to the camera. Uh, this is the trade back you got to you know have here when it comes to flashing on ROMs. Uh, you're going to have some instability when when it comes to the firmware, uh, which is a bit annoying. But nevertheless, it is uh, nice to see a stock uh, build here for the. Uh, A5 because usually the mid-range phones aren't really supported when it comes to uh, your ROMs. You also obviously get all the Google kind of wallpapers here like the official stock ones as well as some of these downloadable ones which are quite good uh, in general. Let's try this one. So it looks pretty nice that one I've got to say. Uh, let's have a look at what else we get here. Let's go into the set. Oh, I think we have something there. Audio effects. Uh, so you can customize the audio experience a little bit more here. I'm guessing when you put some headphones in, you'll be able to, uh, you know, do the bass and virtualizer. Let's try the settings. So, so have a look in display, uh, live display, accidental wake up, expanded desktop. Some nice features here gestures, double tap to sleep. That seems to work. And you do have the lock screen here, which gives you access to the camera and also let's have a look at the battery bar settings uh, so let's just go back here mm -hmm. there you go different here for the battery 
Uh, some nice settings and customization in here then if you want to go that far. Uh, buttons you can see as well, you can change the backlight. Uh, so as I said, you know, I will leave a link in the description if you want to check out uh, this Nugget build. I would say, you know, it is uh, having some issues with stability in terms of the the camera and the fingerprint sensor so it could be you know a little bit of a double edged sword here do we have multi-user support let's just try no I don't like it uh, so for some reason they have gotten rid of that but yeah just a quick little video here checking out uh, Android 7.1.2 Nugget uh, hopefully it won't be too long until Samsung puts the official software on, which hopefully we will check out. And uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.